So let us now uh, go into your education background. Come to a stage where you could get into this ACIO. And tell me which all schools you have studied in, schools, colleges, how has been your academic performance in terms of percentage marks, your position in the class, uh, the subjects that you like, subjects that you're not very keen on, the teachers whom you regarded or admired, teachers you are not very uh, impressed with, uh, the kind of game, sports and extracurricular activity that were available in your school college and the activities you have actively taken part in. Any achievements in any of these fields? Any challenges? Tell me about these. And also about your friends who are who have been your close friends, why you consider them so. And uh, yeah, you can start from class 9th onwards. Yes, sir. Uh, sir, I have done my education from Kendriya Vidhalaya National Police Academy, which is there in my campus only, sir. So it's, it was from CBSC board. In 9th, I scored uh, 93%. In 10th, I scored 10 CGPA, which is equivalent to 95%. Then afterwards, there's a choice whether I choose MPC or YPC, Arts, Commerce, or there's an even combination that is MYPC. So I thought to opt for MYPC because I know in very of the competitive exams, max, and there are some questions of biology too. Mm -hmm. So I think I'll have a good base and even I'll have a proper uh, choice later on in which field I want to take. So I have taken MYPC. And uh, I have continued in the Kendra Vidhyalaya only, sir after 10th also and in 11th i scored 87% and in 12th also i scored 86.6 percentage so after that i pursued my engineering from vasavi college of engineering under electrical and electronics background mm -hmm. uh, there also sir i uh, my cgpa in the last uh, after all the semester was 9.21 when it comes to the subjects which i like uh, it's electrical machines and uh, control systems are the subjects which really interested me uh, because I could see the machines working. If there is something theory, I was able to see it practically also. And the subject where I fe uh, felt a bit difficulty was power electronics because it was quite uh, difficult to understand for me because if there is something happening, if an electron is moving or the how the transistor is working, I was not able to see it properly or kaise hota. And also, sir, uh, the thing is maybe I was not very open to the teacher to ask the doubts because he... He never encouraged us to ask or clear our doubts mm. because of the, uh, which I could not uh, get power electronics very much interested to. And when it comes to teachers, sir, I think my head of the department, HOD, he was so humble and he always used to tell me, Arzu, if you do not understand any of the subjects, you can just come to me. Even in my emotional part, like if I'm not well, I'm not able to attend the class, but still I'm coming to the classes. So he was, he used to encourage me, okay, no, no issues, just take a tablet, sit here. If any issues are there, just come to me. And also my electric machines, sir, he was always there back of me for any of the doubts. Apart from electric machines, I used to even clarify my doubts of power electronics with him. And uh, when it comes to this uh, teacher, uh, with whom I did not felt much comfortable was only power electronics, sir, because I could not clear my doubts and that used to be there in my head always. And uh, when so was this the case only with you or uh, about others also? Yes, sir. Even other people faced this uh, same problem. So they were taking gate coaching outside. So that notes we all used to distribute in the class and we used to prepare for our exams, sir. Yes, sir. when it comes to the games and sports, in my college, I started playing uh, games. Uh, it was, I am thankful to my PT teacher that uh, there was a running race and all the people were involved in some other fest preparation. So he just called me and he told, Arzu, you bhago. And there were around 60 girls in the lot of 10, 10, we were asked to run. And I didn't know that, okay, I have ability to even run so fast. And at that time, I made it to the first prize. From that time, sir used to push me, ki aap handball khelo. you just come for the practice also. And from that time, I started maintaining my physical fitness, like every day morning, getting up, uh, skipping every day, cycling every day, having a good diet, including eggs and uh, milk in my diet every day after exercise. So this is uh, the games. And when so which class was this? So this was in my first year of my college. Uh, my PT teacher encouraged me to participate, sir. So not, not uh, anything in the school? In school, I was more into uh, drills, 
such as if there is a sports day participation so there's a uh, platoon or there's a parade which used to take part so i used to be uh, participate in the parade and all but not in the sports much sir. i was into extra curricular activities more and when it comes to the extra curricular activities in the college i was always uh, the one who used to participate in any of the activities in my college whether it is paper presentation debate sessions uh, just a minute talks or any of these sessions i used to participate and even bagged a lot of prizes and uh, when it comes to the achievement in my college sir i was given the best student award which is uh, and also young leader award for young leader award they see 10 of the criteria such as our academics our discipline our participation in the games and sports our our, our extra curricular activities how we held our juniors how we organized some of the fest in the college and how we participated or represented college at the state level so on by seeing all these criteria i was given the uh, award of the young leader award which is given for the one student out of all the batching uh, passing out batch sir and uh, when it comes to the friend sir in college yes i was having a, a very good friend circle but uh, because i was a very sincere student i never used to uh, miss any of the class so my friends used to always think this girl is not going to give us company in the movie you just sit in the class so that we can get your notes during examination but mm -hmm. yes i am so blessed to have the beautiful friend circle in my training sir and these people are always there in my high and low times and mm -hmm. even these are the people who are very happy with uh, my success even when i scored the highest marks in the training these people are the people who celebrated my success more than me and uh, i think it's i'm blessed to have these people as my friends sir mm -hmm.